Hello, Underground family. You guys may not know me, but I know all of you. My name is Chance. More musically known as Shadow Boy. And there's been something that's been going on for many years now that needs to be put to a stop. And that is all undergrounders and jugglers having a bad name. I am honestly getting tired of seeing it. We are not a gang. We are an underground music based family. There is a difference. Calling us a gang is like calling the Black Belt Brides Army a gang. Or like calling the Lincoln Park Underground Fan Club a gang. That's like calling Skillet fans a gang. That's like calling Kiss fans, Nirvana fans, Godsmack fans. Again, I say the time to fight back against this terror is now. All these people that go out of their way to commit violence in the name of our family is not family. That is a gang member. Because of them, we are labeled a gang. How is that our fault that these people go out and commit these acts of murder just because they decide to take the lyrics too serious? It needs to stop. The violence, the hate amongst psychopathic and MNE needs to stop. Instead of spreading all this hate, we need to come together and show the government that we are not a gang, that we are a family. And look at all of you here right now. All walks of life, all colors of skin, all shapes and sizes, everyone is welcome. Everyone amongst us is free. Free to be who they are. Free to be themselves. Just because we wear a certain logo and represent you know, some dark, murderistic music that doesn't make us bad people. Just because we talk about it in our songs. Because let me tell you something. I talk a lot about dark stuff in a lot of my songs. Tupac Shakur talked about murder, blood, violence every day in all of his work. And he became a world leader in the music industry. And to this day, he is still considered a god amongst musicians and artists everywhere all over the world. So instead of putting out violence and murder, I still spread a little more love, caring, understanding for each other. We need to stop this violence, guys. It needs to stop. Psychopathic needs to stop beefing with fucking MNE Entertainment and get back on track where they used to be. Because let me tell you something. The underground is what saved my life as a teenager. When I was 15, 16, 17 years old, I was in that state of mind where I felt like I didn't fit in with anybody. Then when I came across the underground, that's when everything changed for me. It turned my life around. It made me the person that I am today. I have no regrets of that. Do I condone violence? Musically, like if you're talking about it lyrically from an artist standpoint like myself, yes. But to actually go out and commit these acts of murders? No. And for those of you that are parents that don't want your kids listening to this stuff, 
It should be your job as a parent to parent these kids and not let them listen to it. And I do apologize for darkness. My lamp doesn't work, so I have to use TV light. And for those of you that don't know, I am making a brother family to back up the Juggalos. I am making a brother family to the Juggalos to support you guys, to show my support of the underground. That's why, and honestly, calling all undergrounders a gang is not right. Everybody starts in the underground. Eminem, one of the greatest fucking hip hop artists of all time, started in the underground. On that. There. And it's just a channel that doesn't have anything on it, so I can see. But it needs to stop. I'm sick and tired of seeing people bashing on people. I'm sick and tired of people saying you have to be jumped in or you have to have a tattoo to be down. Let me tell you something. I own zero hatchet here. Zero. And you know how I represent? This. I don't own any hatchet here, so I represent with this. My old North High School hoodie. The end stands for North High School, but to me, those cross hatchets on the back of this represent you guys, my underground family. And honestly, I would gladly stand toe to toe next to you guys in your time of need within this war. We need to bring this war with the government to an end and show them that we are not a gang. I say our time to rise up and end all this confrontation is now. I say we stand up, we fight back, and we show them that we are not a gang by weeding out all gang members who treat this as a gang. It needs to stop. Some of my best friends in the world, who I saw as family, died for this. They died trying to stop all this. They died trying to free us. They died trying to defend our name, not only as a fan base, but as a family. And tomorrow, I'll be unveiling the official logo for the Brother Clan of the Juggalos. So all Juggalos in the entire underground, just know that my clan, the Immortal Guardians, are with you. We have your back. Yes, we're only three strong right now, but in due time, that number will rise. And we will show the government that we are not a gang, that we are a family. Because let me tell you something, some of my biggest fans in the entire fucking world are underground. They're everything from fucking Juggalos, Cyberdog, Steampunk. You know, freaking cyberpunk. I have fans of all races, all walks of life. And I appreciate every single one of them. And for those of you that want to judge, you don't have that right to judge. Just because we dress a certain way and look a certain way, that don't mean we're a gang. That don't mean we are how we dress. Like me, I dress a certain way during my performances, yes. I'll throw my hat corner side, 
and I'll fucking throw on something like this and my fan mail chain along with my Japanese bandana. But that doesn't mean I'm a bad person. That is my stage persona. That is what I put out there as my public figure. See, on stage, like right now, like this right here doing this is my stage. Doing live streams is my performance. That is my venue. That is my stage. That's how I put my music out there. This, when I perform on here for you guys, that is completely different from my normal everyday life. Yes, I might act one way on stage in front of my fans, but when I'm off stage, I act completely different. Ask anybody that knows me. Anybody in the world that knows me knows that I act completely different than I do on stage. Just like ICP and Twisted, they act completely different on stage than they do off stage. Every artist and every band does that. When you're on stage, your persona is what you put out there. Your name is your business of what you put out there. When you're off stage, a lot of people are a lot different off stage than they are on stage. And I think a lot of today. If this cuts out, I do apologize. Because my connection is not that great. So I do apologize if it cuts out and goes back in. But as I was saying, I think a lot of society today forgets where artists come from. They forget where they started. I'll admit, I have some of the best fans all over the world. Do I make any money off of it? Not really. But honestly, Every single one of those fans is worth more to me than any of the money in the world. Because let me tell you guys something. If you guys know the band Suicide Silence, you guys know that Mitch Walker, who was actually a dear friend of mine, passed away in 2012 due to a motorcycle accident. On stage, he acted like a straight-up beast. He acted as a front man. He acted a certain way on stage. But off stage, what was he? He was a father to his daughter. He was a husband to his wife, a son to his parents, a brother to his sister. He took care of his family. He was the kindest person you could ever want to meet. And one thing he always said that still to this day sticks with me personally that I think a lot of people need to remember. And there's something he told Mark and all the guys all the time. Without the fans, this band ain't shit. And it's completely true. Without the fans, there would be no music. There would be no hip hop. There would be no rock or core. There wouldn't be any music that is out today. And I think people tend to forget that Without the fans, you go nowhere. Without the fans, where's your music going? What are you doing with your life? Granted, I don't make any money as of yet, but I still have the most incredible fan base I could ever ask for. Does that make my fan base a gang? Just because I talk about in my songs, does that them? No. Let me tell you guys something. Allow me to raise this flag to honor our brothers, our sisters, our families who have died to defending the juggalos. I raise this flag in honor of I raise this flag in honor of my clan. Guys, I do apologize if it cuts out. I may have to start over. I don't know. But 
allow me to raise this flag in honor of our brothers, our sisters, who have fallen to defend us. This flag of the immortal guardians is promised to defend all juggalos. The age of the underground is here, people. 2017 is our year. And I will continue to raise and wave this flag to the day I die to defend every single one of you, to protect, defend those that cannot defend themselves. I say it's time we stand up for ourselves. We stop hiding in fear from the government. We stop hiding in fear of public, of society. Now is our time, guys. Don't just do this for our family that is around today. Do it for those that have lost their lives. Defending what it truly means to be family. Let's defend this. Let's put a stop to this, guys. I want every single one of you to gather together with me now and pray that we can end this and put an end to this senseless war. It needs to stop. Because you want to know something? A few months back, one of my closest friends was alone. He was murdered at his brother's work. He wasn't doing anything wrong. He was murdered. All because he was one of us. And that right there should be a hate crime. But it's not, because the government has to label those a gang. We are not a gang. We are a family. I'm tired of seeing the hate. I'm tired of seeing family bashing on each other. I'm tired of seeing psychopathic ripping on MNE. I'm tired of seeing MNE having to fight back against psychopath. It needs to stop. Instead of fighting, we need to come together. We need to fight back against this and put an end to this senseless war. I see it every day on my lawn. I'm honestly getting tired of it. I'm tired of seeing family fight with each other. I'm tired of it. And it's not just us. It's all over the other ground. You got gothic people bashing on gothic people. You got cyber goths bashing on cyber goths. You got steampunk who's caught in the middle of this, who doesn't know what the hell's going on and why they're being hated on. You got cyberpunk guys who rip on literally everyone. It needs to stop. The underground is supposed to be a place of peace. It's supposed to be a place where everybody can come in and be themselves and express themselves and get out of the public society's judgment. It needs to stop, guys. Seriously. And if you guys do not know, Outcast Records unfortunately did get taken down today because of people who hate on what I'm part of. I had to shut it down today. So I do apologize to all my artists on the label. You guys will not be let go. You guys will be part of the new label that myself and my newest member, TJ, 
and his wife are starting out together, hopefully. It needs to stop, guys. And as a matter of fact, I have something for you guys. This is a song I recorded for the family a while back. I'm going to pull it up for you guys. Yeah. 
you've got for every single one of you watching this right now. As I said, our time is now. We need to fight back, guys. I'm tired of seeing friends and family die. All because of people wanting to go out and commit acts of murder in our name. Yeah. One thing I'm this is just... Nothing else But as I said, guys, I'm sick and tired of seeing friends, family, loved ones. People who are even fans of mine being killed because of what they are. Being killed because they can relate with us. Some of my best friends in the world who are some of my close friends, some of them even family to me, are undergrounders, jugglers, jugglers, all of that. They are all spectrums of the underground. So I promise you, every single one of you, with everything I have, I will help lead us to end this war. Because I'm tired of seeing us being labeled as a gang. I'm tired of seeing us fighting. And if you guys agree with this, I want you guys to share this everywhere. And I mean everywhere. Your mom, your dad, your aunt, your uncle, everybody. I want the entire world to see this video. I want the entire world to know that we will not back down that we will keep on fighting for our rights. Because society sees us as this underground joke, thinking that we don't have rights just because we relate to what we are. But let me tell you something right now. To all of you who are hating on us, fuck you. I protect those who help me. I defend those who cannot defend themselves. I protect the weak and the defenseless. I help family whether I know them or not. I help them out in any way that I can when they need it. That is what being true family is all about. Helping each other. Whether you know the person or not, if you see that they need help, do what you can to help them. Do what you have to do to get that person to a positive state. Because let me tell you something. I know a lot of people who, you know, were talking about acts of suicide. Who wanted to end their lives. But when I brought them in, all of that changed for them, including for me. So honestly, guys, I say our time to fight back is now. This year is going to be our year. And if we play our cards right, we can put an end to all this. But I need your guys' help. I want the entire world I want ICP to see this shit. I want Tech 9 twisted. I want everybody, every level back all over the world to see this live stream. The hate, the violence, the anger, it needs to end right now. So instead of hating on each other, let's teach people. Let's teach people what we are truly about. Let's defend against those who hate on us. Let's defend those who are feeling alone. Let's fight back against those who wish to do us harm. With that being said, guys, with Chance, also known as Shadowblade, 
not necessarily as kind of this thing is fucking huge. But to all my loves and lets, all my immortal guardians, all my undergrounds, I love every single one of you guys. I got you back for life. I promise you that. As I said, guys, I need you all to share this around everywhere. Hell, if you can, upload it to YouTube if you have to. Like, I want everybody all over the world to see this. To see that we are not a gang. We are a family. And whether I know this low or light or not, I'll defend every single low and light I come across. I will help them out in every way I can. And that's what being a true family is all about. Whether you're underground or not, it's just automatic. You know, if you see somebody in trouble, help them. If you see somebody who needs assistance in some way or another, whether it be just as simple as listening, be there for them. Help them in any way that you can. I know I have a lot of problems that I deal with, that a lot of my family and friends have helped me with. Our time is now, guys. Let's put down our weapons. Let's put down the hate. Now let's pick up the exact opposite of that. They start spreading love, caring, understanding for each other. Let's show the government 